Well, she went from homeless on the streets of San Diego to standing center stage at the Oscars. Now a young San Diegan is giving back to the place where her art took shape. Ten News reporter John Carroll is live in National City with today's celebration of Innocente and what she plans to do next. John? Preston, I'm standing in front of that place. It's called the Art Center of National City. It's where the art of Innocente Izucar was nourished. And now that she's become famous for being the subject of an Oscar-winning documentary, this place is thriving. The applause just keep on coming for Innocente Izucar. Her life changed the night the film about the San Diego teen won Oscar gold. And the Oscar goes to Innocente. Back where it started for her, Innocente talked about how the Oscar has opened new doors to pursue her love of art and to share it with others. This year I want to do advocacy, so that's really going to happen for me, and I'm really excited to go to conferences and schools and talk about the power of art. The power of art is what the at-risk young people at A Reason to Survive are immersed in from the moment they walk in the door. That was true of Innocente, and it's true for the generation right behind her. I've gotten to work with so many different artists here. It's really great because if you don't know how to do something art-wise, you can always find somebody who does. Innocente's story, the subject of the documentary about her, focused on how she struggled through homelessness and found the purpose of her life through art. For the young people who find their artistic way here, the place and the people are just as important as the paint and canvas. I came into this program and didn't really have anybody but my mom. And as soon as I walked in the doors, everybody welcomed me and I'm treated so well here. And for this place that helped Innocente so much, her fame is allowing her to repay the favor. To inspire people, the importance of arts education, the importance of dreaming, and overcoming your struggles. And so if we can get that message out and then help people do the work that we do, we'll have that much more of an impact. Now, one other nice side effect of Innocente's film, she says since it has found such a wide audience and had such success, her relationship with her mom has improved. Live in National City, John Carroll, 10 News.